doing the smart thing. Are you? So yesterday was a bit of a disaster, <laughs> this is the slush. Today the condition is completely opposite, it's minus 12 degrees. Did you see it? It was minus 12 degrees when we left the car. Yeah. And um, so everything is not slushy, just powdery snow and just a little colder. We're trying a different lake today, um, but for the same species. Well, this is totally different from yesterday. Oh! Add one. Got one? Yeah. <gasps> oh! Oh! What do I do? What do I do? It's a brookie. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. My, my drag's so tight. You want your brookie, that's what it is. Perfect. But how do I, what do you do? Stand up? Yeah. Yes, my little brookie. Nice. He wasn't big, I lied. Ah, finally. Okay, so they like the worms. I've moved on from Rod, and now I got my own show. No, I'm under, I'm joking. I'm I'm on as high from that little fish, and I don't know what to say. <laughs> We're at a lake that holds rainbow trout. You have your Panask rainbow trouts, your Fraser valleys, and we have our brookies here. And um, we actually dug a number of holes right along this line. And what's so nice about where we kind of picked today is we were actually in the same location back in spring and my husband Dan, who's with us, um, he laid pins of where he was catching lots of fish last time. This is so different from yesterday because yesterday you could look down the hole and see everything. And here, you cannot see, not see anything until the fish is actually right underneath the ice, which yeah. almost makes it more exciting because every time I've ice fished, I've never had it this clear on the surface. Mm -hmm. So you can actually see the fish fighting right underneath you mm, when you yeah, get it up to the top. Yeah. The, well, the water's pretty dark, but I think once we put up the tent, uh, w w you can probably see more. Uh, Dan, we yeah. already had this talk and he thinks that it didn't really matter. I think, well, I think the lighting, because there's so much snow, uh, it's, it, it's quite bright, right? So that's why water seems quite a bit darker. Um, but we'll see. But I this want my book <laughs> Yeah. I got it. Yeah. But um, we're attempting Kitty's first episode on her channel here. Um, so we need more fish. <laughs> she needs more fish. <laughs> Same size as rods yesterday. Is it a panask? Yeah. It was. 
That was a nice, that was, that hit just as hard as the other one. That's almost. awesome, look at this, wow. That's bigger than Rod's. No, I think it's about the same. Rod, that's big, that's big. Dan, that's big. Dan is so big. Yes, Dan, 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 Still only caught one fish in three days. I wouldn't be happy that one. <laughs> We need more practice in cooking in the wild. <laughs> I can't eat it. This is not bad. Yeah. That's actually pretty good. For on the ice? That's pretty good. Way better than yesterday's lunch. Chips and pepperoni. I give this ice lunch a 10 out of 10. The potatoes, nice, light, and fluffy, perfectly seasoned. Evenly mashed. The steak, well, <laughs> I think it was the cut of meat that wasn't the best. But the cook on it was nice, almost a blue rare. And the peppers, the mixed veggies, they're pretty decent too. We should do this every fishing trip. Oh yeah, it's good sizzle. It's good sizzle. Let's see how she is. Oh. Oh. Oh damn! It is a good thing. Oh, yeah. this is way better. Yeah. Tummy satisfied. Now we're ready for a, ready for a cup of tea, <laughs> and uh, just in time for the bites to come on around three o'clock. <laughs> He's still there. Pull. He still got it. I don't know if it's there now, is it? It's, it's so frozen. Yeah, it's still there. Still there. Yeah, you got him. Nice kitty. I can't do anything. A small, small mask. We'll keep that. Want it? Yeah. Yes, finally! Nice little fish. Little? So we just had lunch and came out from the tent. I was, I literally was eating steak and I had the fork in my hand so I was taking a big bite and then I saw my rod go off. Hit it, hit it. Did you get it? Yep. You watch that, Dan? Oh! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Cut. Can I have the again. propane out, please? <laughs> it's a little guy again. Oh! Oh, he got it. He has it. It came back, eh? Ah, oh, still oh, the same. It's a little one. Kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. 
grab it. It's still up. Oh, yeah, it's a good fish. Wait, real I love it. You lost it. It was like your rod was like. I couldn't. Dead. And it was so frozen. I couldn't oh, do anything. Your rod was like right there. Did you not see me do the slide? What? I don't take me off. I do take me off sometimes. I feel like I'm in the jinx squad. Dan's right. You need to move further away. I'm sorry. Well, oh no! <laughs> no! What happened? <laughs> you like, you like silence, and then... Well, the two cups of tea I have are really good. Oh, I took like one sip. Like, this is really good. Fish, fish! Find a 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 fish. Find a fish. It did, it did. Well, today's fishing was way more successful than yesterday. Numerous bites, each landing several fish. We got to see three species. Nice Fraser Valley from Daniel, some Panasks, and lots of Brookies. Even though there was more success, I still have no idea how to ice fish properly. I don't know if I'm successful or being effective half of the time. I wish I knew how the fish were acting down there, but it was really dark for us to see. Um, we couldn't peer down the hole like you could yesterday. I guess just the bottom with all the weeds, it makes it so dark. And the water was, um, the visibility was, it was quite murky. Mm -hmm. So. We had about 10 minutes of daylight left to fish. My hands are freezing because temperature is dropping really fast. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, this is kind of like our first attempt at getting some videos up on Kitty's channel. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Um, there should be more to come. Click on that notification bell so you can get notified when the next video comes out. And make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. Don't forget. Um, yeah, until next time, good, good luck fishing. fishing.